Some good news. A lemonade stand is helping shelter animals. How one local girl turned her boredom into making those animals' lives better. Meet nine-year-old Bree Barger. Say hi, Barger. She has a big love for animals. Even when you're sad, there's they're someone to listen to you, someone to cuddle with when you don't feel the best, like if you feel sick or upset about something. They're just always here for you. At just six years old, Bree wanted to help shelter animals. I've loved animals from a very young age, and I just really feel bad for them in those situations, like puppy mills and stuff. Well, I really like community service, and I like animals, so why not combine this together? Because I was just kind of bored. I wanted something to do. So she came up with the idea of having a lemonade stand and all of the money from sales she uses to purchase donations for the Putnam County Animal Shelter. It makes me feel really proud and happy that I can give them a nice time at the shelter and actually let them know what love is. For just four hours, she sets up shop selling lemonade and sweet treats in her neighborhood and then after heads to a local pet store to stock up on supplies. This sale from over the summer, she was able to raise more than $500. She brought us toys, food, um, just stuff that we really need, paper towels, uh, Dawn, she helped us with some cleaning supplies, she helped the animals you know, with bringing food and toys. It's awesome that kids really want to get into it and actually help you know, their, their county shelter because it's huge. Tiffany DeBoard is director of the shelter. She says shelters all over the state are extremely full. We're definitely seeing an influx of a lot of dogs, a lot of cats, um, a lot of animals that haven't been fixed and that need fixed, a lot of cats and dogs that need help. DeBoard says donations like this help the animals in more ways than one. Wet food, dry food, uh, most of that is donated to the shelter. Um, that way we can use those funds to, like for vet bills and to help sick kittens or sick dogs and help them get the help they need. So once we get these donations, that might be another animal that we can help that's in need. We know the Putnam County Animal Shelter went through a rough patch last year. DeBoard tells me they've done a complete turnaround. We've come up with cleaning protocols and procedures. Um, we clean every day. We disinfect every day. Every animal gets blankets. Um, they get a clean bowl every single day. So it's a lot of work to try to make sure everything's clean every single day. Working with KCHA has been huge because they've helped us implement a lot of uh, cleaning protocols, feeding, um, and the playgroups are huge. Three years and four lemonade stands later, Bree has raised a little more than $1,500, all to help the local shelter pets in Putnam County. Please adopt from shelters. It's really hard. I'm sure it's very hard for them like to just see others getting adopted and just sit there. Come and check out your local shelter. You don't know, maybe you'll find something you like. Bree tells me she'll continue to have her lemonade stands each year to continue to help out the animals. And if you'd like to help, DeBoard encourages adoption and fostering and says the shelter is always in need of volunteers. Reporting for Eyewitness News, I'm Gina Marini.